Hey guys, I'm going to go ahead and open up my iPhone settings and you're going to see something pretty cool. So let me just go ahead and go down general and about. I'm on iOS 14.5, the newest version. And in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys exactly to jailbreak completely for free without a computer on this new version of iOS. So let's get right into the video and I'm going to show you guys exactly what you need to do. So what you want to do is go to this site right here. It's called uncover.vip. You want to substitute an O for a zero. So this is the site right here, uncover.vip. This is through the Uncovered Jailbreak. And once you're on the site, you wanna go ahead and press the blue button that says Jailbreak. And after you do that, it's gonna install configuration profiles. Press allow and close. And now we just have to reopen settings to install the profile. Press where it says profile downloaded. And then you just wanna go ahead and press install. And now we just need to go ahead and press install again. And now we're done. So let's press done, go to our home screen, and there's the Uncovered Jailbreak app. So what we need to do is go ahead and open this and give it a second to load, and there will be a button that says Jailbreak. So what you want to do is go ahead and press on this. You can see it says Ready to Jailbreak. So it is working. It's super cool. So when you press Jailbreak, it's going to go ahead and ensure the resources. It's going to go ahead and do everything needed for the Jailbreak. So let's go ahead and give it a second. All right, jailbreak nearly finished. So we just need to press continue. Sometimes an error might occur, something like that. Um, so let's give it a second. And basically what we need to do is this quick verification step. So all we need to do is download two of these apps, complete instructions. So these are completely free. They're from the official app store. For my first app, I went with IRL social calendar. So let's give it a second to bring me over to the store. I'm gonna download it. And then I'm gonna go back to the page and download another app. So let's go ahead and go back. And for my next app, I'll go with State of Survival. This is a game. It's going to take me back over to the App Store, and I'm just going to go ahead and download it. Now I'm going to go to my home screen, give it a minute for both of these to download. They're not that big, so this shouldn't take that long. And all I have to do is complete the instructions specified, and my device should be jailbroken. So it's literally that simple. The IRO social calendar is already downloaded, so I'm going to go ahead and open it up. And basically, instructions for this app were very straightforward. I just had to go ahead and sign up for an account. It's really easy, so I'm just going to go ahead and type in an email address right here, as you can see. All right, okay, I'm just going to go ahead and do that. Okay, here we go. So let me just go ahead and type this in. All right, okay, let me just type in it correctly, and it will send me a code. Now, these apps can vary according to where you live, so you could see different apps than me, but this is what I did. I did the account in our own social calendar, and boom, I'm done. So what I'm going to do now is go ahead and move on to the other app. So that was the game, State of Survival. So the game was very simple. I just had to go ahead and basically play it for a bit, complete some interactions in the game. Usually if there's a game, there might be a tutorial. There's usually nothing that confusing. You don't have to be like a pro at it or anything. So let's give it a second to load here, as you can see. All right, it's loading right now. Okay, almost done, the loading settlement. Okay, so the game is loaded, so now I'm just gonna go ahead and play around with it. Touch around, maybe complete some tasks. This is like a building game, so it's pretty cool. So let me just go ahead and do this for a little bit, as you can see, all right. Okay, alrighty, almost done. I'm just gonna go ahead and do this for a little bit more, and we should be good to go. So I'm just gonna go ahead and touch around, as you can see, okay. All right, yeah, this is not that difficult, guys. This is pretty simple. So I'm gonna go ahead and just build some stuff, touch around, as you can see, really, really easy, and we should be good to go. So let's just keep doing it for a bit more. All right, okay, there we go, almost done. All right, okay, just gonna build this headquarters, upgrade, touch around, whatever, so we're done. So now I'm going to go ahead and go back to my home screen and it should trigger a jailbroken state. So let's give it a second and any moment now, Cydia will either appear or there we go. The jailbroken state is happening. So as you can see, it's going to show you this little apple. It almost looks like an update or a progress bar. It's completely normal. This is what happens when you jailbreak. So let's give it a minute to go ahead and finish here as you can see. All right. Okay. It's almost done. Now this might take a while. It depends on like internet connectivity speeds and stuff like that. So let's let it load, and it looks like we're in. So I'm gonna open my phone up, and let's see if Cydia is available. And there it is, so super cool. So as you can see guys, I did this all without a computer, I didn't pay any, any fees or anything, and it is super insane, newest version of iOS. So you can see Cydia is fully working. Now, there's even more proof I can show. 
I'm gonna go ahead and download a jailbreak theme onto my device, just to show you guys that this is fully working. So you can see right here, all the tweaks, all the different things that you can go ahead and do is fully working. So let's go in the search bar and I'm gonna go ahead and search for Lotus. This is a theme, it looks pretty cool. I'm gonna go ahead and download it. So let's press confirm and there it goes. So let's give it a second to go ahead and finish. It should work. Um, okay, there we go. You can see it in action downloading Lotus. So as you can see, there we go. All right, almost done. Just gonna give it a second to finish. And boom, it looks like we're completed reloading data. All right, so now I'm gonna go ahead and go to my home screen and let's see if we got it. So as you can see, there's the Lotus theme, Insidia. So let's swipe back and boom, there it is. So I really hope you guys enjoyed the video. Definitely go ahead and share this with your friends. Get the word out about this method, super cool. See you guys later, peace out.